All right, I think we're live. Oh yeah. Hello, hello, let me see. Got this iPad to see some comments and stuff. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Hey, there's somebody, Rosie. Caitlin Rose, what's up? Here, I'm trying to get on with this thing so I can read all your comments. Hang on a second. Let's see, posts, no. Hmm, nothing's happening on here, so I guess I'm just gonna read comments on here. Oh, Megan Schick is here, what's up? Hi everybody, hi Carla. I love the beginning of going live because it's just saying hi to everybody and seeing how many people are just coming in and saying what's up. Hello everybody. So you guys, this is like my first time going live on Facebook um, from the Plain White Tees Facebook. And um, I know you guys, I'm hoping you're all aware of what we did, but we did an actual poll asking you what songs you wanted to hear. We gave you 10 options and um, we took the, the five highest voted songs. And uh, I'm actually pretty stoked on, on the results here. Uh, a couple songs I haven't played in a while, a couple that I, I play all the time. So this will be fun. So thank you guys for being a part of this. Super cool and thanks for watching. Uh, let's see, what is it, a Wednesday night? I guess there's not much better to do on a Wednesday night in quarantine, right? So. Ah. Uh, all right, I'm gonna try to read some comments here and then we'll get to some music. Michael Shanker, Aubrey. Oh, this is cool. There's actually a lot of people that I don't know. Please play Lonely September. That is on the set list. That was voted in. So I will be playing Lonely September. Um, do you guys wanna know the songs or do you want it to be a surprise? Because there's five songs I'm gonna play. Or did they already like, did they already announce it? I'm not sure. Maybe they announced it, but. Oh, happy to see you guys too. Oh yeah. All right, how about I just start playing and if you guys have comments for me, I'll try to scroll through and uh, see some, some comments. If you have questions or whatever, hit me up. Um, but first song that you guys voted in is uh, Should Have Gone To Bed. So here we go. I'll try to play a little quieter so you can hear my voice. Miss you at midnight when that lonely clock strikes. That's when I wish you were here. The angel knows it's not right. The devil's in my heart tonight, whispering things in my ear. So I down my cup, and then I hit you up. I should have never 
call, yeah. I shouldn't listen to my head when it said leave it. Shouldn't just gone to bed. I should have never called you. I shouldn't listen to my head when it said leave it alone. No few drinks in. Here I go to see you again. God only knows what I said. I should have just gone to bed. Oh yeah, thank you, thank you. I hear the thunderous applause. It's like we're at a real show here, this is amazing. Hello, hello. Clapping around my, oh, you can't clap, okay, because you got dogs. I understand, it's okay, I get you. I respect that, I know you're clapping on the inside and that's all that matters. Ah, uh, all right, so do we have any questions or anything? Um, let's see. Josh, is Hather Delilah one of them? Surprisingly, Hather Delilah did not get voted in to the top five. Probably because if you guys have seen me, I've been going on Instagram Live and stuff a lot. So, um, and I've been playing Delilah. Of course, we usually have to play that every time. So I think that all the fans were like, no, play something else. So that's pretty cool that I'm, excuse me, actually not playing Delilah in this little Facebook Live. Um... Let's see. Amy Carter, I love you. Hey, what's up? Love you. Favorite song to play? Um, that's a great question. I don't really know. I don't really have a favorite song. Delilah is really fun to play live because everybody's like singing along and stuff. We make it a nice moment when we do live shows. Um, but in general, I always love playing like the latest song. I feel like that's always really fun because it's fresh and it's new and uh, you know, the fans are excited to hear it because they've never seen it live. So usually the newest song is the most fun to play. Your locks look great. Hey, thank you. I credit that to um, my guy, Zach Schneider. He cuts my hair and uh, I haven't gotten a haircut in like four months and somehow it still looks decent. So props to him. Uh, how about Pause? Oh, that's a great song. So that wasn't on the list this, this week for uh, the the choices, but maybe next week we'll put that one on. I think I want to do, try to do this with you guys so we, you can give you the chance to vote and make the set list like every week or two. I think it would be fun just to check in and do a quick little live thing and have you guys pick the songs. That'll be fun. Um, so yeah, so no pause on today's set. Um, let's see, one more question. Giving tree, fireworks stop. Fireworks are stop. Oh man, I, those were not on the list either, but I almost put fireworks on the list. That would be cool. Um, let's see, light up the room, also not on the list. I'm sorry, you guys. Now you're giving me ideas, so next week when we do it, I'll know what to put on the list, and then you guys can fight it out. Hello from Washington. What's up? Uh, how are you? I'm good. Thanks for asking. I'm feeling pretty good. Um, yeah, I mean, I'm not, not really leaving my house at all, so I'm getting a little bit stir-crazy, but I uh, took a nice walk today. Um, me and my son went for a walk around the neighborhood and then we sat outside for a little while on our little patio So getting a little bit of fresh air. It's finally getting nice here in Chicago So that's pretty cool to be able to you know, even though it's not really going out just to leave your house feels good You know, I'm sure you guys can relate to that. But anyway, I'm gonna keep on playing songs the next one on my little set list here that you guys voted in I actually talked about earlier because somebody had requested it on here uh, this is called A Lonely September. This is from our first album, Stop. Here we go. Can be 
convince myself that you're not the one for me But the more I think, the less I believe it And the more I want you here with me You know the holidays are coming up Trying to entertain myself with this old guitar But with all my inspiration gone It's not getting me very far I look around my room and everything I see Reminds me of you Oh please baby won't you take my hand we got nothing left to September, more like a lonely March, April, and May. Am I right? Am I right? Let's come back in for the comments here. Ah, uh, Jen Barber, thank you. You're welcome. Sounded great. Thank you. Heck yeah. Thanks, Carla. Awesome. You guys are awesome. Oh yeah, thank you guys. Um, so is there any, any other questions? I don't know, I know there's, I still have three more songs to play, so. The next song is actually kind of a, kind of an old one too. It's off our uh, second album, All That We Needed. Do you ever forget the words to your own, thanks a lot, now you're gonna jinx me. Yeah, I do sometimes, for sure. Especially if I haven't been playing them in a while, like most of these songs, so. I better not screw up the words now that you said that. Um, can't wait till the next tour. I know. I know. Me too. Can't wait to just play a show again outside of my living room. You know, I've been doing a lot of shows in here, but that kind of doesn't count. I don't know. Throwbacks. Yep. Yeah, I tried to, when, when I put songs up for, for people to vote, I tried to, you know, obviously include some of the, the hits because people usually want to hear those, but then I want, I tried to throw some of like, some older, cooler song, not cooler, but you know, some more, less known songs in there uh, to kind of make it fun for the fans and let people decide. And I'm stoked on what you guys came up with. So far, Should Have Gone to Bed and Lonely September. 
And up next, from the All That We Needed album, we've got the very first song we ever shot a video for. Uh, if you check the video out for this song, it's like literally all our friends in the video in like American Apparel clothes, like in a basement show. That was that was our uh, kind of our storyboard for the video. And our buddy Jay Martin, he made a kick-ass video out of it. So this is called Take Me Away. <clears throat> I know we just got here, but I think it's time to go. I didn't want to believe it, but now I know who just walked in. some explosions we're getting some applause thank you guys <laughs> uh, oh man we've got some good requests here okay so next week next week we are gonna do this again and we're gonna make all new requests so you guys can fight it out for what songs and now that I see what you guys are putting in here now I got an idea for you know what songs to put on the um, on the ballot for next week So I got two more songs to do on this little, on this little Facebook live. Um, but how's everybody doing? You guys doing okay? How's everybody handling uh, the quarantine? I know some places are starting to open up. Chicago is still pretty locked down. That's where I'm at right now. Um, so nothing much has changed yet, except for like I said, the weather is getting nicer. So that makes it a little easier. Um, but yeah, we're still we're still keeping it pretty chill over here. But it's kind of weird. It's like, I, I, I like that some places are opening up because it's, you know, of course you want things to get back to normal. But then a part of me is also like, but wait, it's kind of too early because we don't really have anything under control yet. So I don't know. I'm kind of torn up inside. I don't know how to really feel about this. Miss Neil. Miss Neil. Oh my God. That's pretty amazing that you know that song. How did that even go? Okay, yeah, 
got Miss Neil. That's a real old song. That must have been like a local fan because literally haven't played that song in 20 years probably. So that was cool. Taking me back. Taking me back. Hopefully this takes everybody back to when, you know, we used to go to concerts all the time and we used to like see our friends all the time. Man, it's funny how much you would miss just something like going to a concert, something you kind of do all the time, or at least obviously we did, but you know, I'm sure all you guys always went to shows and it's like, man, to go to a show right now would be so fun. Um, you're nervous, yeah, to be one of the first people to go out. I know, that's how I feel. It's like, it seems like a little bit too soon. I don't know. I think even when Chicago opens up, I probably will like still chill for a little bit, you know? Um, just for my own, I mean, and for everybody else, you know, it's like the more people stay home, I think the safer everybody is still. So I don't know. It's like, you gotta just think about everybody else, you know, think about everybody's health. Um, let's see, just bought a house at the beach and waiting for it. I love that. <sighs> Excuse me. That sounds pretty badass. Uh, writing any new songs during quarantine? Quarantine, Yeah, so I am. I have, uh, me and Tim uh, have been going back and forth a little bit, sending some ideas to each other. I've also, I don't know if you guys have heard Million Miler. It's like my 80s uh, solo project that I've been doing on the side. Um, and I've been writing for that. I'm trying to finish an album up with them, I'm trying to start work on the next Play My Tease album. So I've been trying to write as much as possible. Um, sometimes it's, it's hard because all you want to do is just sit around all day and do nothing. And I think that's okay too. But then sometimes I get inspired and I actually sit right here on this couch and I'll spend hours a day just like writing and trying to come up with ideas. So yeah, always trying to stay busy. But if you guys haven't checked out Million Miler, you gotta check it out. Uh, super fun 80s synth pop stuff. Um, just me doing it on the side with Plain White Tees, really fun. Um, so cool how you're friends with Fairview. Yeah, Fairview too. If you guys don't know them, you gotta check them out. Uh, the best. Fairview is the best. Best people and amazing, amazing music. So, and they're on my label, Humans Were Here, uh, which you guys should also follow, Humans Were Here, my record label. I'm using, this is like a Tom Higginson commercial, apparently. I don't know. You guys keep leading me into these, uh, into these paths, but yeah. A Million Miler is hot. Thank you. Thank you, Erica. I appreciate that. Um, having surgery in two weeks, so not going out except for grocery. Yeah, exactly. That's good. I'm sorry you're having surgery. I hope you're going to be okay. I'm sure you will be. Um, but yeah, just go out for the essentials. That's me right now for sure. Oh, okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get back to, uh, are you going to bring back the stash? I love it. Yeah, I think I will. I think I will. I've just been like, you know, I let it grow to like a beard and then I just shave it off. And then, you know, I try to, I'm trying to do as little as possible uh, hygiene wise, you know, so my once a week shave, at, if that, is about it. So I haven't been worrying about the mustache or anything really, so yeah. Um, all right, how about I play another song? Got two more songs. Um, I, apparently this one got the most votes out of any of the songs that I put, out of the 10 songs <clears throat> we put on the poll for this week. This was the absolute winner with the most votes which is pretty cool. I kind of feel like if we would have put this song out as a single after Hey There Delilah, I think it might have been uh, a pretty big hit for us um, because it seems like a lot of people connected with it. So here you go, <clears throat> your number one voted song. And then I got one more after this, but this is Write You a Song.
can't say where we'll go, but the one thing I know is how to be a good man to you. Until I die, that's what I'll do. Thank you guys. I love that song. I love that song. So thank you. Thanks for that request. Very cool. Um, so I'm down to my last song. So is there any other, any other questions, any other comments? Um, let's see. We got some, some applause. Thank you very much. And some hearts. That's awesome. Thank you. Thank you guys for watching, by the way. This is super cool. By the way, we've got a, like, there was 400 something people. Now there's 300 people. This is really awesome. When I do these things on Instagram, there's like a like hundred people maybe. So you guys got to pay attention. Follow us on Instagram because I do this a lot more over there. So follow me at Higgy Pop, like Tom Higginson, Higgy Pop. And follow at Plain White Tees on Instagram. Um, like I said, at Million Miler Music is my uh, my side project. Humans were here, my label. All the guys in, in the band have their own Instagrams. We're all posting a bunch of stuff on there. So you got to follow. IG, that's where I do most of my stuff. That's where I live on social media. You're amazing. Thanks, Alex. From Thailand? Oh, my God. Cheers. That's incredible. Thailand. We are global right now. Thanks for being awesome. Oh, thank you, Jamie. Your hair looks, I keep getting all these compliments on my hair. It's crazy. Thank you very much. Thank you. I'm really not doing much to it. I just get out of the shower and it looks like this. So pretty cool. What show have you binge watched? You know, I haven't really been watching shows. I've been watching a bunch of movies. I've been trying to catch up. All those years of touring, um, you know, I would, I would buy, I would like stockpile DVDs and Blu-rays because we'd be like in some city and I'd be like go shopping or something at a record store and I'd be like, oh my God, I, this movie looks so good. I never saw it. So I would buy it and then bring it home. And so I have literally like a pile of DVDs and Blu-rays that I've never watched that I wanted to see. So I've been trying to like catch up on movies in, the, uh, in this quarantine. So that's what I've been doing. Writing a lot of music and watching a lot of movies. Uh, also listening to, uh, to The Strokes and The Weeknd. Have you guys watched the In Your Eyes video by the weekend? If not, you should. It's like one of my favorite videos of all time. And one of my favorite songs of all time. So yeah, the weekend put out a new record in quarantine and so did the Strokes. They all had them done before, uh, before quarantine started and those are two of my favorite artists ever. So I've enjoyed getting to listen to that. That's, that's gotten me through some of this quarantine for sure. Mexico, hello. I love you. You're so pretty. Oh, thank you. You know, I'm pretty. It's because I have long hair, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> um, okay, I got one more song for you guys, and then I'm gonna, I'm gonna take off. Um, but yeah, for real, like follow all the Instagram accounts, Higgy Pop at Plain White Tees, because if you guys are tuning into this. We go on a bunch from uh, from those accounts too. So on Instagram, get over there. Follow us if you guys aren't following. Uh, favorite movie so far? You know what I watched the other day? Harold and Maude. You guys know that movie? It's like an old movie from the 70s. It's about this like, you know, 22 year old kid who's like, like really bored with life. He like goes to funerals for fun. Like he's just kind of a reject. 
and he meets this like 80 year old woman and they become like friends and they kind of fall in love it's like a really quirky movie but it was so funny and such a cool movie so i would recommend harold and maude to everybody for sure um let's see favorite quarantine snack huh um nuts i've been eating a lot of nuts lately yeah and i've been i've been actually attempting to i've been cooking a lot i've been i've been mastering my chef skills and also i've been making some drinks um i've been trying to make some of my favorite cocktails homemade style and it's actually gone pretty good i can make a really mean eastern standard which is like my favorite drink of all time so i've been enjoying uh those you know every couple weekends i'll make myself a nice eastern standard yeah yeah um the cat stevens soundtrack exactly yeah yeah you know harold and Maude. that's so cool peanut butter falcon oh my god i just watched honey boy as well honey boy amazing amazing movie shia labeouf and i did i saw peanut butter falcon in the theaters and i loved it that was so good um i love this hairstyle the best oh thank you you guys are too nice this is super cool um love harold and Maude. there you go okay yeah i could do this all day so I tell you what, I'm going to play one more song and then I'm going to take off and then we're going to do this again within the next two weeks. This will happen again on Instagram with the votes and getting everybody to chime in with their, you know, what songs they want to hear and uh, follow at Higgy Pop at Plain White Tees on Instagram because there'll be some stuff happening on those accounts as well. Um, so yeah, I'm going to play one more song. This one was not so much of a surprise. Um, I expected for sure that Delilah and 1234 would be voted on. And it's just crazy that Delilah wasn't and 1234 was. So thank you guys. I'm, I'm a, obviously a big fan of all my songs, but 1234 has a, has a special place in my heart for sure. So, so this one goes out to anybody that voted for it. Um, and then, yeah, maybe I'll answer a couple questions and then I'll sign off after this one. So one, two, one, two, three, four. I love you, there's only 
thank you guys so much. Ah, that felt good. I feel good about this. Facebook Live. So yeah, I'm gonna do this again. I know in case anybody's just tuning in and just caught the last song or the last couple songs. Uh, we let everybody vote. I put up 10 songs and people voted for the five songs that they wanted to see me play live. And I just played those five. They were Should Have Gone to Bed, A Lonely September, Take Me Away, Write You a Song, and One, Two, Three, Four. Uh, and um, we're gonna put another poll up and we're gonna do this again in about a week or so, a week and a half. So be following on Facebook. And if you wanna hear a song, you gotta vote for it. And uh, we'll see you again soon. And uh, also gonna be going live on Instagram at Plain White Tees or my personal account at Higgy Pop. So make sure you're following both of those accounts. Uh, I'm also writing a ton of music and producing a lot of music and I'm always posting the, the stuff I'm working on on the Higgy Pop account. So you gotta follow along and hear some new fresh music uh, from outside Plain White Tees. I'm working with other artists and stuff. So yeah, so uh, just keep on following along. Keep on staying safe. Keep staying in if you can. Um, and uh, also, hopefully, some new Plain White Tees music coming after the quarantine. Like I said, me and Tim are bouncing back some ideas. So we're, uh, there's going to be a whole bunch of new music coming very soon, as soon as this, all this is over. So love you guys. Thanks for tuning in. Um, made my day. Oh, thank you. That's so cool that people are watching from around the world, by the way. So that means a lot to, to me and I'm sure the rest of the guys. Um, so yeah, thank you, everybody. And I'm going to sign off now, so everybody be safe. It's uh, about to be sunset here in Chicago, so everybody have a nice night or morning, wherever you're at. And uh, we'll see you real soon. Bye. Thank you.